Welcome to the sixth episode in our mini video series. We're going to take a look at how Datical makes it easier than ever to fulfill audit requests and report on database changes across your organization. This is the Deployment Management Console, and this is a handy interface that helps me understand what's going on with each database within my pipelines at a very high level, and it makes it easy for me to clearly articulate status to the rest of the organization. We also keep track of velocity, and this is essentially the time it takes from a change being introduced to the system to that change reaching this stage within the pipeline. This helps you quickly identify any bottlenecks in your process so you can address them and get change moving freely through the system again. If you work in a highly regulated industry such as financial services or healthcare, uh, there can be an audit at any moment. So while it's important to know the high level status of the databases in your purview, you also need to be able to you know, clearly communicate what changes have been made, when those changes were made, who made those changes, and why the changes were made. And for that, we have our reports interface. So this is really just a list of every operation that's ever, hap ever happened to these databases as part of this project. Um, and to keep you from scrolling through the full list every time you need to answer a question, we've got these filter fields up here. So let's say I need to know about all of my production deployments in April. I'd simply add the prod context here to let them know that I'm interested in prod, production pushes only. I'll set the uh, start date to April 1st, and that's going to narrow down my selection quite a bit. So now I can see that there were two production deployments um, in April. One is part of pipeline one, one is part of pipeline two. To answer the more minute questions, more granular questions, the who, what, where, when, and why, I can take a look at the individual report for each one of these deployments just by clicking on the link that's associated with it in the reports table. And this has all the information you'd ever want to know, not only about the changes that were applied, but the runtime environment as well. You can see you've got all of that metadata up here about the when, from where, uh, and how long it took. And then we, as we go down in the report, we get more and more granular. So we have sort of a summary of the impact to the tables that were um, uh, touched as part of this deployment. And then we have a breakdown of the individual changes themselves. This has a lot of helpful information, like the labels that associate them with the JIRA efforts and the pipeline that um, this work was done in. So you can quickly understand why a change was made. You can say, understand who made the change. And then you can get all sorts of information about what happened during that change. So we've got the SQL that was run to affect that change before and after states all sorts of information about the individual changes that were a part of a specific deploy. This is a really short example of how Datical can make reporting and the fulfillment of audit requests much, much easier than they are today. Uh, if you're interested in seeing more, please request a demo. We'd love to show it to you.